for the outward journey of service. The true revolutionists and pilgrims of this world. Ponder these words from Romans chapter 8. Only those are children of God who are led by God's Spirit. And if children of God, then heirs, heirs of God, and joint heirs with Christ Jesus. Walter Rauschenbusch said, It seems to me that to possess the Spirit of God is the most effective revolutionary equipment. Those that have it are independent above anyone in the world. They have the great companion ever with them, whose presence Jesus declared to be better than his own visible companionship. They can at any time lean back and feel the eternal rock supporting them. They stand among their neighbors in state and church, sharing with them, serving them, but not mastered by them. The feeble aspirations of their fluttering human spirit are borne up on the eagle wings of that mightier spirit. Their conscience is quickened and steadied by reference to that inward guide. The true revolutionists, the pilgrims of this world, the children of eternity, need that abiding presence if they would have wisdom not to stumble at the critical movement, boldness not to flinch, strength to seize the opportunity and a serene and hopeful faith that even a desert wind cannot scorch. Today we pray with Rauschenbusch for our cities and our communities. He prayed, help us to make our community the greater home of our people where all may live their lives in comfort unafraid, living their lives in peace and rounding out their years in strength. May we remember that our community's true wealth and greatness consists not in the abundance of the things we possess, but in the justice of her institutions and the kinship of her children. Make her rich in her sons and daughters, and famous through the lofty passions that inspire them. Amen.